we just go? Oh, kind of we're going into there. River Drift this time. Yeah, it's River Drift for game one. We How does this differ from both. Thunder Point? Oh yeah, River Drift is like the complete opposite. You want to block your opponent so you can base build. It's not like Thunder. Um, it's not like Thunder Point where you want to go aggressive. It's the complete opposite. And hmm. we're seeing an uh, interesting starting starter from Prof there. Um, not the best one, I would say. There are better ones. Oh, and they're not getting the cards. This is not good. Yeah, it, it's one of those like, yeah, they could definitely could do better, but they're not going to be able to. So I see that this is one of those situations where you kind of have to play with what you're given. And we'll have to see if uh, Gyro or Euro is going to be able to make this work. But basically, because the cards needed to set up a good defense aren't there, they are going to be like, you know what? I know this is a defensive stage. I don't care. I need to break through. I need to take this out. <laughs> I need to steal as much turf as possible. Because they have the perfect hand for aggression. <laughs> And now we're gonna drizzle right all over their stage. But their area is completely open, so if they do that... Okay. Like, this is one of those situations where you want to try to get the right read. If they get the right read, they can shut down Squidman hard. But if they don't, uh, it kind nothing really happens and both continue to just... Play Ooh, we got the read! Squidman still has a way to break through, but I think this is... Oh, yeah. This is a good play. Both players are in the spawn from, uh... Yeah, both players are in the spawn from each other. Wow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is... This is the other way you can play River Drift. You just... Yeah, go aggressive. Wow, and that was a clean ink brush. This ink brush yeah. allows Squidman to get into the spawn and destroy everything. Yeah, wow. that was a that was a read on Squidman's part. I had a feeling when I saw that corner piece get set up that I'm like, Squidman's probably planning something specifically to capitalize on that corner. Yeah, but it's it's not looking that good for Prof right now because they also don't have any big cards to place right now. They only got like yeah, no, that's a. Job. It's a bunch of good cards for building special, which means that as it currently stands, uh, they do have the special lead. And fortunately, the point difference is only five. You can come back from this easy. Oh, yeah. It's when you're in a position where you only have small cards and you and your opponent has such a greater lead then it's scary but right now it's I've seen worse places to be yeah definitely wow I I wow I missed it Ooh, that's a pretty good card though. That's deep. No, that's only deep in the lead by two points. But yeah, now we're getting to the point where everything's kind of been funneled down. All we've got is a suction bomb. The suction bomb, oh no. But oh, yeah, they're jump. able to get one special point out of that suction bomb there. Oh wow, and they're getting the card on clutch and they still have that special lead, which is insane. I can't see it. Oh wow, uh, yeah. Here. They got their stringer. Stinger. Ooh. And oh, they're not going for that special. They're going for nothing. Okay. Yeah. Oh, granted, they still I have plenty of special. Wow. They should uh, have enough to. If they play this right, they should have enough. If they have two three twelves, to be able to play both of them. Do they? Oh, no, yeah, they but it's already turn two. They need to pass now, so 
Uh, they can only place one special. They lost. Maybe they lost the 50 50 there? No, they did yeah. not. It wasn't even a 50 50. No, like they can still bring this bad. back, but it's like a scary position to be in. Yeah, basically, it's uh, impossible, I would say. You, if Squidman just has like one okay special, it would be enough. Squidman just needs that's only one okay special. Yeah, but yeah, there's Squidman. I think Squidman has this, but it's. Okay, Squidman is using the charger. Oh, and I'm not sure if that was a good one. I don't let's see. Oh, oh and, and Squidman continues this win streak going up to four. Yeah. Whitman is kind of killing everyone right now. Winning against everyone. It's you very, know, because Squidman's got that Min Min energy. And Min Min yeah, is win win in arms. So win -win. Squidman is also win win. Arms next. Squidman win win. Oh, that's, that's too much for my head. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I have a uh, habit. Fine. I, I have, uh, I'm that a sounds interesting. You know what you're talking about. I'm. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm good at rambling. You want to hear about my OCs? <laughs> oh no, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we're gonna we're gonna go to Thunder Point now. They were wanting to play aggressive anyway, so we might as well go to the more aggressive stage. Yeah, and. Um. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we're going on Thunder. Yeah. Oh. There we go. Will Squidman get the silver crown, or will Prof get the um? Yeah. Get the crown from Squidman. Oh, Squidman getting that. DJ Octavio and oh that's an interesting Ooh. way to place it. I can't see they... the fight again. Oh yeah, that's so interesting. No, uh Ooh. Squid Squidman got that DJ Octavio, but I'm not sure what they want to like how they want to use it after that. Because there's I feel like that was a little too safe. Ooh, nice yeah. denial there. We have Squidman has guarded their turf. And wow. now it's on and now it's up to Hero to be able to try to block off, but I feel like this is a really safe play. Just was not confident in the defense there, and arguably, possibly for the best there. Yeah, they need to, now we're gonna. They need the aggressive card now to get into Prof spawn. Mm -hmm. That said, it might be more. Oh, well, there's a few good aggressive cards. It's a two. Two point hallway. There's a lot of cards that can fit through that kind of space. Yeah, and then we see one of them, Spellcharm and Wiper, getting into the spawn. Wow, and it's okay. It's not looking good for Prof there. Indeed, it is not. Oh, Prof is looking to block everything. Uh, yeah. Everything possible, but. He will not be able to do that, and so is Squidman in the spawn of Prof. Even more, like, yeah, wow, this, ama this is amazing from Squidman there. We are now in panic zone. That is a terrible Dynamo, but he's just like, they're gonna steal all my stuff. I can't let them do that. This is my home. You he can't take my dynamo. home. Wow. Inkbrush is like, lol, lamau. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, and Prof needs special points or something to get into the spawn from Squidman, but they cannot get anything. Oh, you can get one special point out of that. Just... Okay, interesting. I just, like... 
trying to run uh, the card, he would be able to get special points, but they don't want to get special points. Okay. Maybe they did not see it. Oh wow, I did not realize, but Scoff, uh, uh, no, Squidman used Captain Net there. Uh, Squidman mm. used combo. <laughs> Uh, combo with Captain and DJ Octavio. Wow, that's 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 a cool combo. But I'm I wonder how they want to like um go on with their cards. Yeah, there's a pretty good forge spot. There's some spots for cards. Let's see. Okay, Prof getting special points now. Four turns With left. Suction bombs. Yeah, four turns. Wait, this Prof next play probably is going to like define how this ends. Yeah, Squidman really needs to get unlucky so Prof can win. Um, yeah, points right now. Oh, Squidman. Oh, that. Eh, that's an R8 small fry. I think. I think that would. This might be the opening. We've got three turns left. We're gonna make a huge push here. It's gonna yeah, be a desperate one to try to get some kind of momentum. What if we can get those two. What Croft wants to do there is going aggressive and getting one special point, but I don't think. Yeah, they're not deciding to do that. Instead, they're just uh, passing. So they well, can double special now. Yeah, we got two specials coming up hot. We're gonna need those both to really swing things around, but I mean, yeah, it's not, this isn't a bad place to be in. I feel like that special needs to be, there's a lot that is being demanded of this next play. Because yeah. this you want to position it so that you can have the 312 cover as much ground as possible, but you also need to get a special. That is oh, and that is a good one for... Oh, and this is only going to be two points off now. That's a... Is oh, this that's... triple ink streak gonna be enough? I don't think so, because when we look at the graph's special points, just look at... Ooh, I think they're there. seeing a spot in that on that right-hand side. I think I see something. 78, 94. Oh. Yeah, this is a 16 points deficit. Yeah. That said, Squidman if there's card. plenty of room for Squidman to get just a clean 12, like that blue orb on the left side, yeah. that thing is just in the heart thick of things. Yeah, and that's oh. going to close it. That's yeah, a perfect that 312. Perfect. Yeah. 24 points for Squidman there. Wow. Uh, great that was that Spider was Man. close. Yeah, and we saw Thunder Point again. Going aggressive is so important on this map. Mm -hmm. And Squidman got the Silver Crown. <laughs> Amazing. We're going silver in this bracket. Yeah, Squidman for the win. Winman. Yeah, I don't know how to. <laughs> You, you, you're getting there, you're getting there. Squidman for the win-win. Squidman for the win-win? There you go. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't that hard at the end. And we just go again <laughs> on Thunder Point again. Let's go. So much Thunder Point. People love this map. I mean, <laughs> you, you can see it. When... I mean, especially, I can imagine, like, maybe in more experienced players, being effectively defensive is really satisfying. But in early, like, especially as you're learning this game, I can imagine little more, more fun than just breaking into somebody's house and just stealing all their turf and running away cackling like a demon. Like... Oh, yeah, that better things. <laughs> this is just... Yeah. Wow, oh, and Ooh, that Pierce! Prof is just going and killing everything my Prof just 
You need to defend your own base. No, defend your own base first. No, no. take it, take it, take it. You scared okay. Squidman, we got the pierce. Take more, Squidman might be scared right now. Take no. more base. <laughs> Both would be equally good place. Uh, the problem here is that uh, Prof doesn't have anything too strong, and also, yeah, the ink brush would have just broke through anyways. So, I yes. think this is a good play. We saw an ink brush moment. Both players use ink brush in the same turn. Yeah. Okay, you yeah, know. Squidman got that whole left side, by the way. Whole top left. Wow, and yeah, that's there's, a lot of space. Squidman has some really good turf to be able to claim now. If only that ink brush was could be could have been used to like break into there instead. That would have been oh yeah, that absolutely would have been good. Wow, Ooh, the moss! Yeah, that moss activates two special points for Prof and activates itself. Prof getting that getting that tent attack perfect on time in time. So that he can now special in. Uh, not special, he can just go in. Yeah, that thing oh, is no, it's so getting needed right now. Oh, but it, we're gonna get into Dunisle. And yeah, now we're going back into the classic I have no space and I must scream. Yeah, but they get, they get to place two cards there. Uh, uh, oh, it doesn't no, really mean much when you're at a 20 point deficit. <laughs> Oh yeah, but if Scribman needs to pass on, oh, that would be that would uh, it would be uh, good for them. Like for Prof. Yeah. Like Squidman's in a very, very contentious or like advantageous position where there's they don't have a any special, which they do need to start charging up for the next few turns. But a clean oh, twenty point lead. Wow, well, there's your special. You still got yeah. that lead. Oh no, wow! What? We just. Oh my goodness! They just use. They just both use their Platana Wiper and. Yeah, that's it's what like happens. If both, if both gods clash with each other, there is, there is a wall of blocks then. Because both cards have the same size and. Yeah. Same sizes clash with each other. And yeah. We have a wall now. But this also means none of the players getting a special point. So mm -hmm. we don't see down we will not see double special now. Oh uh, no, I don't think so. Oh Prof losing that 50-50 again. That's not good. That's so hard. Oh, Prof. Yeah. Uh, I think they're considering to- yeah. Th I don't think you can come back from this. Yeah, definitely. I question if winning the 50-50 would have even given the win still. This is just... Uh, they maybe would have been able to double special, so... Yeah, you- That's you, true. You will not know. Yeah, unfortunately yeah, we do not unlucky. get to see. Oh no! Losing two 50-50s! I did They... They lost the 66 33 Oh no! Wow! Hey, uh, unfortunate. Got... One more play! Can Prof yes, turn I... this around? There is enough of a different... There is a short enough distance. It's just barely enough that they do get the chance. The question is, will it be enough? We see the double charger, but which charger would be, which charger was better? Is it Squidwin's one? Yeah! Ooh yeah, Squidman just barely holding on to that. Yeah, Squidman taking that win-win there. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> <laughs>